Hello friends, welcome to GK Code Labs. Today we are going to tell you that how you can make a change to a file without affecting its timestamp. We'll be telling you how to do this in both Linux and Windows environment. So we have a very simple trick to do this. So we'll start with the Linux environment first. Let me take you to my Linux virtual machine. So here is my terminal. Okay, so I'm creating a file here. Say file one dot txt. Okay, so as we can see, the file is created, and currently the timestamp is obviously the current time 1133. So we'll wait for some time and uh, make the change in a minute or two then we'll demonstrate how the timestamp is preserved and we can do it with any file okay so it's almost two minutes now first thing you have to do is create another dummy file with the same timestamp which we want to preserve so how you will do that touch hyphen r whatever file you have created and a new dummy file so now you can see dummy file is created with the same timestamp 1133 so now you can go ahead and edit your file i'll use vi editor here Hello. Okay, I will save it. Now you can see as we have edited the file, the timestamp has got updated. Now what you have to do is taking hyphen R stands for reference. So taking reference of dummy file we will touch file one once again and there you can see your file timestamp is back to 1133 you can also see we have all our contents so now we are going to tell you how you will do same things on windows platform so getting back to my windows machine Okay, so I have created a test folder here. So we'll create a text file. Let's get back in a couple of minutes and try to edit it. Okay, so it's almost two minutes now. You can still see the file timestamp is 1140 when it was created. Now let's go ahead and edit it. going to save it you can see timestamp got updated the original timestamp was 1140 so now how we can restore this timestamp for this we are going to use PowerShell if you do not have PowerShell installed on your system you can go ahead and install it from Microsoft website it's not a third-party application you can download it genuinely from Microsoft website You can go ahead and download it from here so I have got this installed already on my computer to access this folder in PowerShell you can just go ahead and type PowerShell okay so now here we can see we have the file with updated timestamp now we'll see how we can move it back to 1140 you have to type this function. This is an inbuilt PowerShell function. You can get this entire command in the description of this video. So here is the function. 
as get item is a built-in powershell function which can be used to modify the last write time or the creation time of a file this get date will get the current date of your system and we are overriding this with whatever the timestamp we want okay then we can now go ahead and see the timestamp is back to 1140 so these were the two simple tricks on both Linux and Windows platform that you can use to edit a file and restore back the timestamp. Thank you for watching this video. Please do subscribe to our channel. If you like our video, please hit that like button. We'll be back with more interesting videos. See you guys. Bye bye.